Good morning, everybody, and happy Wednesday. Thank you so much for joining me. Today is Wellness Wednesday. We are coming to you live the first Wednesday of every month for our Wednesday Wellness Series. We're going to give you some stress busters and some tips that you can use um, for getting through this year. So uh, today we're doing crafting, one of the things that I really like to do. So we're going to be making stress balls because stress balls um, can really help you. They're, it, Here's a stress ball I made before. It's, it's something that you can do with your hand. It's a kind of a fidget toy, and it allows your brain to filter out some of the other sensory information. It actually allows you to focus better. So let's get started. So what you're gonna need, really easy, um, balloons, a filter, oops, and rice, which is now all over the floor in my house. So um, you can also do this using flour. I like rice, I like the texture of um, the rice inside my stress ball, but you can use it using flour, seeds, other things like that. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna take your um, balloon. This balloon will be on the inside, so it really doesn't matter the color. And I'm gonna just um, put it over my funnel. Now, if you don't have a funnel, you can actually make one. Oh, that looks very large. You can make one out of paper. I just twisted up a roll of paper. I'd probably cut that. And then you have a do-it-yourself filter, uh, sorry, funnel. So all you do is you're gonna take this funnel, um, attach it to my balloon, and then I'm just gonna pour rice into the funnel and start to fill my balloon with rice. And the tip that I have is to take a pencil and sort of just try to help poke it down through the funnel. It gets it into the balloon faster and a little bit easier. Uh, the key to making a good stress ball is really to pack it down tight. So you really wanna make sure that you're packing down your rice or your flour or your popcorn seeds, whatever you're using, um, really, really hard into your balloon. That is what you um, are going to need to make a really good stress ball. So you're gonna pack it down, pack it down. I'm gonna put a little bit more rice into mine. And um, again, I'm just gonna take my pencil and just poke it down through the funnel to get it really uh, packed really tightly into my balloon. Um, if you think you have enough rice in your stress ball, you're wrong, you don't, you need more. So make sure that you're packing it really tightly, um, getting all that rice in there and packing it down super tightly. Um, fidget toys like stress balls or um, other types of fidget toys have been known to reduce anxiety and stress. So um, sometimes people will use it while they're working on the computer or while they're thinking, just to have something to do with their hands and keep their hands busy. So here's an easy craft to do to make it. So I have enough rice in there now, so I'm gonna take off my funnel. Ooh, rice everywhere. And then you want to, again, pack it down really tightly. And then I'm just gonna tie uh, my balloon into a knot. So you wanna tie a nice tight knot. And then what you will do is you're gonna take your scissors and you're gonna cut off the end. Now you don't wanna cut it too close to the knot because you don't want the knot to um, undo, but you don't wanna leave all this hanging out because that's gonna um, go into inside the, of your stress ball. So there you go, so that's, that's the inside. Then you're gonna take another balloon and you can either take one the same color or you can take a different color and have like a two-toned stress ball. And all you're gonna do is cut off the neck of the balloon and then you're gonna open it up. And now this is really important. Where that um, tie, where that knot is, that goes inside your second balloon. That way, if for some reason that knot comes open, you don't have rice everywhere. This is super important. So you're gonna take that, you're gonna open up your second balloon, and you're gonna just stretch it over your rice-filled balloon. And there you go, an easy stress ball. And now you can either leave it like that. The texture is really good. I like it. Like I said, you can use flour, anything else you want, other seeds, popcorn. But I like rice. I like the texture of rice. You can leave it like that so it's one color. Or some other ones that I've done in the past. Uh, let's see. So this one is a two-tone where I just cut out sort of um, a second balloon. I cut holes in it and then I covered. That's, got, uh, that's a third layer on top of my balloons. You can also take Sharpies and decorate it. You can also make Ninja Turtles. So all sorts of different things you can do. Um, this has been our Wen Wellness Wednesday Stress Busters. Thank you for joining me, for crafting with me, making stress balls. I hope you go and make a stress ball. Um, very soothing, easy craft to do. 
I hope everyone has a great day. Get outside today. Be well, be active. Have a great day.